to the fallout from that nasty fight yesterday between LSU and South Carolina women's basketball teams. Yeah, pretty wild there. Multiple players ejected and an LSU player's brother was arrested after jumping onto the court. For the very latest on this, sports reporter Kendall Duncan joins us live in studio. Kendall, a lot to unpack from this ugly incident. Yeah, y'all said it. A really intense and ugly situation yesterday in the SEC championship game when multiple players from both LSU and South Carolina would be ejected. And now we know the fallout from the dust up, which includes one arrest. So let me take you through the events. Late in the fourth quarter of this highly competitive matchup, Flaw J. Johnson would intentionally foul a South Carolina player. Johnson and some Gamecocks would exchange some words and a shove, but the real altercation started when Camila Cardosa came up and forcefully pushed the LSU guard to the ground. And that's when Johnson's brother, Trayron Milton, would hop the scores table into the action on the court. That's a big no-no for fans. So all day yesterday, we heard conflicting reports of the fate of Milton, but the Greenville Police Department releasing today that Milton was indeed arrested after the scuffle and has been charged with assault. This comes after Milton pushed down someone's head and stepped on her shoulders to get over the table and onto the court. He has been charged with third degree assault and battery and disorderly conduct. Here's what Kim Mulkey had to say after the altercation. It's ugly. It's not good. Um, no one wants to be a part of that. No one wants to see, to, to see that ugliness. But I can tell you this, I wish she would have pushed Angel Reese. Don't push a kid that you six, eight, don't push somebody that little. That, that was uncalled for, in my opinion. Let those two girls that were jawing, let them go at it. Well, SEC Commissioner Greg Sankey commenting on the matter today, saying the game was great, but quote, I'm highly disappointed in the incident that took place late in the game and regret that it took focus off of what was otherwise a successful championship event, end quote. Guys. All right, Ken.